Hello, I'm Mark Crea, uh, CEO of Feed My Starving Children, and I'm here to tell you Violet's story. Uh, Violet was a, a young girl I met in Uganda. She had recently fled from the conflict in Sudan, um, and her story is not a unique one, but is a powerful one. And the difference that you can play and that Feed My Starving Children's Food plays in, in the rescue of her and, and her life. Um, at 12 years old, one day her mother, uh, the conflict that was going on in their village, the village was being attacked. She told Violet to simply run. They left through the back door, run, hide, and then run some more. And these three children, over a, a period of a couple of weeks, ran 250 miles into Uganda. Uh, that in, in Minnesota, that's like running from Minneapolis-St. Paul to the Canadian border. These, these young children uh, arriving at a refugee camp that is operated by Feed the Hungry, one of our main partners there. You know, physically, they were in just, in just terrible shape, terrible shape. For them uh, to get there, to be cared for, to be fed, that began to rebuild them. They're now in school there in this, in this camp, and Violet is an awesome student. She wants to become an accountant. She wants to help other children in that similar situation. And as she was telling me this story, and not knowing whether or not her mother was still alive, um, the tears, the emotion was just under the surface. But through all of that, she wanted to make it very clear. The message to all of you is, first of all, thank you. Thank you for this food. Thank you for the ability to, to help rebuild her life. Please continue to pray for her and for all the children that are in similar situations. That's what she's gonna dedicate her life to do, to helping other children. And so simply, on behalf of all of them, all of the children around the world we feed, thank you and God bless you.